I gotta freshen up. Oh my god. It's been a while. It's been a while, guys. It's been a while since I last filmed. And if you hear kids in the background, it's because there's kids in my house, okay? But anyway, hello! I'm so freaking excited to be back and also kind of nervous because it's been a good three or two or three weeks since I last posted on YouTube, which honestly, I don't think it's that long. Like, it hasn't been a month yet so we're good but it is longer than i usually take to post and that's because i have been struggling in my personal life um so i'm not gonna give an explanation i needed some time off of youtube and just like time to get away from everything and everyone but um i won't go into detail about anything because i don't want to talk about it and that's completely okay and i'm honestly i don't feel i don't feel too bad that i stopped posting just for a little bit because i seriously needed that time for myself how However, I missed you guys so much. I did miss posting like I honestly was a little bit stressed out that I wasn't posting and um, I have some vlog footage from the weeks prior to me having a little mental breakdown my first mental breakdown of February Which is when like everything bad started anyway I'm not getting into it, but all of this is where we left off last and so I'm doing a story time because I do have a lot of footage And also I didn't want to post these vlogs separately because then you guys would have been so confused So I just wanted to catch up so the the last footage that I have starts on February 11th. So I was in Miami doing some stuff. <laughs> stuff, yeah. Okay, Jillian. Not exciting stuff, but I needed my mom and her boyfriend's help. So that's the reason that I went to Miami. Just like adult things. Sorry, I'm adjusting my chair. This video is already a mess. But I had gone to the mall with my sister and this is mall shenanigans getting your eyebrows threaded is actually torture like it's modern day torture but i feel like a new woman so i look like mini mouse <laughs> I always have to include my Target trip. Mateo, where are we? At the Target. I'm the home the Target. Hello, I'm talking. <laughs> I used to come here with Mateo as a, as a baby. <laughs> Look, mommy's right there. This is the parking spot for her right here. <laughs> this is my parking spot. Like somebody's gonna like run me over. <laughs> Watch that not be her. For a second, I panicked and I thought that wasn't her. <laughs> You're like, uh -oh. I was like, oh my god, I just embarrassed myself. <laughs> but it's her. <laughs> He's like, M A T I <laughs> Target. <laughs> Target. <laughs> <laughs> But then after Target, I was trying to do a haul in my sister's room, and then my mom kind of interrupted that, and um, this is what happened. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> And honestly, that might be the best part of this entire video. But then, February 12th, I did do the haul. I wasn't gonna leave you guys hanging, and I tried to do it so many times that, like, I have to include it in this video. Not that exciting, honestly, but here's the little haul. I got some jeans at Urban Outfitters yesterday because I needed some new jeans. And then, I, yesterday, I actually went to the Morphe store, which is why I was so excited to do this haul. So, I got this brush cleaner. You will see why. That was only, like, $9. I also got myself a setting spray. The best part of all of this I got myself the James Charles brush collection with Morphe so this has 34 brushes I saw it there and I was like I need it because I was getting a bunch of like individual brushes I was like why not just get the big the big thing so it comes with this huge case it comes with 34 brushes and it comes with the Morphe uh, sponge thingy say hi Hi. So let's get the day started. Let's get this thing started. <laughs> Actually, very exciting because I got those brushes. Hello. But yeah, we did get the day started. I went to Starbucks. I picked up my drink. I have been drinking too much Starbucks lately because I've been trying so many new drinks. And this is me talking about it. Um, honestly, you guys don't even care. And then comes 
Valentine's Day. Honestly, I forgot that it was Valentine's Day, like, the day before that. And so I woke up that morning stressed out because I hadn't gotten anyone anything. But I did show you guys what I got Mateo. So here's what I ended up getting. Um, I don't know where all the Valentine's Day stuff went. They usually have, like, all the little Valentine's Day stuff in the dollar section or whatever that section is called. Target spot? Whatever. They'll have all the seasonal stuff there that is, like, cheaper. But they just put the St. Patrick's Day stuff out, even though though it is Valentine's Day today so I thought the Valentine's Day stuff was in like a clearance section looked all around the store there was no clearance section they just took everything out so I went to the little section and they had these baskets so I couldn't I couldn't resist I don't know why I have a weird obsession with baskets so I got two of these little ones and a bigger one and I thought I'd use this as like the gift basket I got him these little plates because he needed them I thought I'd just toss these in there I think he'll be happy about it honestly I got him this cup it looks like a little coffee mug I also got him this Mickey Mouse surprise there's a squishy in here and then I have the stuff that I bought whenever a couple days ago because none of this is Valentine's Day themed and I thought they would have Valentine's Day stuff there right but they didn't so I'm glad that I got him this book it's Happy Valentine's Day, Mouse. And I got him surprise eggs. He's gonna be the most excited about this. And I got him this cute little yellow plate. It was a dollar. So, a lot of plates in here, actually. This is his little basket. I knew he was gonna be excited about the cup. <laughs> oh, he's putting it where it goes. <laughs> You're so cute, baby. We have to wash that though. Please. Please. For you. Thank you, mommy. Thank you. You're welcome. Can you give me a kiss? Did you just break it? Yeah. It's literally been two minutes. On that day, we decided to spend it at Disney. Are we gonna take the boat or the monorail? The train. Train. The train? Okay. So we left Disney because I'm hungry. I didn't want to go eat at Disney, first of all, it's so packed. Also, I didn't want to catch traffic because the fireworks show was going on and I was like, let's go before it ends so that we don't catch traffic, even though I really wanted to see it. I got myself a fancy margarita, it's called My Darling. Look how cute, thing. it's so cute. So let me tell you guys what happened last night after the camera turned off. I spent too much money at Disney Springs. I'm gonna do a little haul. I took a shower. I haven't done my skincare routine because I went to Sephora and I picked up some stuff. So I want to use it before I put on all my face stuff. So, oh my god, I am so excited about this. I got my first ever Natasha Denona product. Can you see my makeshift tripod in the reflection? This was definitely an impulse buy. Actually, all of this was an impulse buy. I went in there and I swatched them, and I always swatch Natasha Denona's eyeshadows. It's just, they're all so good. Look at that. Oh my god, look at those shades. I picked up a Summer Fridays jet lag mask. I use this as my lotion, my moisturizer. This is why I went into Sephora in the first place. Because I have heard so much about the Drunk Elephant baby facial. So I went in there for this. It is very pricey. So I'll let you guys know how that goes before you decide to purchase it. I got myself the Born This Way foundation. I've also used this in the past. I needed a new foundation, so... Picked it up. And the last thing that I got myself at Sephora was a Dior lipstick. This is the Rouge Dior in the shade 219 Rose Montaigne. 
First of all, look how pretty this is. Uh-huh. Okay. And then look at the shade. So pretty. I went into this other store called Francesca's. This is the first one, which I actually tried on in the dressing room. I tried both of them on, but this is the only one that I filmed. I didn't film myself trying on the other top, but this is the other one. It's so pretty. And then I decided that I wanted to show you guys the baby facial and um, the first try. So here's that. Okay, I just took off the baby facial. My face is really red right here. But it was like that last night when I got back home. So I'm like, did I get sunburned yesterday? Even though there was like no sun out. I don't know. I don't know why my face is red right here. So I don't think that has anything to do with the mask. And I'm not usually one to get sunburned. So I'm not sure what's happening here. But my skin doesn't look much different. I guess you have to use it multiple times to get a result out of it. But it doesn't even feel softer or anything. So I'm not sure what it's supposed to do. I'll wait a couple weeks and give you guys a final review after a couple tries. Oh, spoon! Oh my gosh. I gave him cereal and I forgot to give him a spoon. I'm so sorry. Here you go. Thank you. You're welcome. So the day after the Thanksgiving, girl, the day after Valentine's Day was kind of a cleaning day for me and like a packing day because I was going to be going on a little, little trip to St. Petersburg, which is like an hour and a half from my house with my mom and my sister and like some of her friends. So this was just one of those days that I had to get things done and I actually was really motivated. All right, I cleaned out my closet a little bit. This is not my side. What happened? Did you hit your head? Yeah, on the table. On the table? Are you okay? I'm okay. Okay. <laughs> Doesn't look different at all. I didn't really get rid of that much today, but I did list some stuff on Poshmark, so make sure to check it out. Not sponsored. And my laundry is kind of almost done. It's like halfway done. But I need to go to Goodwill because I took out some stuff that I'm going to donate. I need to go pick up Ginger's food. I need to take Ginger out, so we're going to do that right now. Why are your shoes up there on the counter? Why are your shoes on the counter? <laughs> don't put your shoes on the counter. They don't go there, they go on the floor. Put on your shoes. They go on your feet, actually. Mateo! <laughs> well, I also just sold some stuff on Poshmark, like literally just now, so I'm gonna go ship that off right now. Be a responsible person and get that done ahead of time. So we're doing things today. We're motivated. <laughs> All right, first stop is done. We got Ginger's food. Oh, no, no, no. That's not good water. No, that's been in the car. Get in your car seat. I do it. Hey, 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 be careful with your head. Be careful with your head. Can you get in your car seat, Mateo? Can you get in your car seat, please? Okay, well, I'm gonna drive off. Come on. Next stop is the post office. I'm not in the school. You're not in school? No. I know. From deep in my soul. It is 7 o'clock at night and I am just now about to start packing. But my mom did just leave Miami, so I don't know. I think I might just go over there in the morning. And that's exactly what I did. Good morning! Today's the day that we go to the beach because we didn't go to sleep, as I said. Oh my god, you're so cute. <laughs> this is Mateo's outfit because it's a little bit windy, but like not cold. And this is my outfit. This bag is not doing good things for me. I'm wearing some jeans and my Lada from Stockholm clogs. Honestly, they're a bit uncomfortable, but I'm still wearing them. And I did my makeup, so I feel good. Let's go, Mateo. We got an hour and a half drive. I want a car. Yeah, we're going to drive. In. Yeah. For Nana? Yeah, we're going to see Nana. Mateo, to drive on the car on the for Nana. Yep. <laughs> Bye, little baby. We will see you tomorrow, I'm pretty sure. Oh, you're so cute and so dirty. <laughs> No. No. He's happy. 
I'm in a really sketchy parking garage. I came to the very top floor because it's like open and I can see things, but it's really weird. I couldn't find parking. I hate driving in a city or like downtown area. It makes me so nervous. I can never find parking. If I do, it's always the wrong spot. It's like no parking between these hours. You know what I mean. And I'm starving and I have to pee. Do you have to pee? No. No? You don't have to go potty? I want to pee the outside right here. You want to pee the outside? I gotta go to the bathroom. <laughs> so we went to eat and I had to come back to my car because I had to change my shoes. I was wearing my my little clogs. They're brand new and they were so uncomfortable. They were hurting my big toes. <laughs> did you get? Chocolate. You got chocolate ice cream? Yeah. What color, what color is your shirt? Orange. Sure. Yellow. Orange. It's yellow. Orange. It's yellow. Orange. Yellow. Orange. Yellow. I see orange. Uh -uh. That's orange. I think that's orange. Dude. <laughs> And now for the second Target trip of this vlog. leaving Target and we're going to the mall. I just decided, I just decided I want to go like to the mall, not to go shopping or anything because I don't have a shopping problem, you know. Yeah, I wanted to go to the mall because I want to find a backpack for Mateo and I because I was looking for a diaper bag because mine broke like a couple months ago and I've been struggling ever since carrying two backpacks, one for me and one for Mateo. So I want to look for one because I'm going on a little road trip. So this trip that I'm talking about, I'll get into that in a minute. We ended up going to the mall and I didn't find a backpack on this day, but that's okay because it's not that interesting. But you guys have to see some of the cuteness. So we went to Starbucks after the mall and there's a section like a fridge where you get to pick up snacks and whatever and Mateo usually gets these plates with like cheese and crackers and like grapes. And so he asked me for one and I said yes and I wish I would have gotten his reaction in the moment. But we did get him to say it again. See if you can figure out what he's singing. <laughs> I like my hair takes so I like it I want it I got it I want it Ouch! <laughs> Kiss this Kiss it? Did you hear it? He was singing Seven Rings so I said yes to him getting it and he was just like I want it I got it Anyway that is the end of the vlog section of this video but to end I just wanted to say that if you see that I'm acting a little bit off in this video or in the videos to come just know that I'm going through a hard time right now but I will be okay everyone is okay and we're just gonna keep things positive around here because I just want my channel to be positive and also realistic so not every day is gonna be super happy and whatever so about the trip that I mentioned I did go to Columbus Georgia as a little vacation to myself and you might be like why Columbus Georgia I grew up in Columbus Georgia from the age of 10 so I moved there from Puerto Rico and that's where I made all the friends that I have now or most of them so I have family there and I decided to go visit my family and my friends and I didn't vlog because I didn't want to and that's totally okay I had a good time we're back people I love you guys thank you so much for the kind messages always you guys don't even know what's going on and you message me and you're like hey I hope you're okay take your time and I just I appreciate that so much. I will see you guys in my next video. <laughs> okay. Bye, guys.